guys, I'm Sharons. It's me, Jasheen. Welcome to my channel, or welcome back to my channel. So, for today's vlog, I am very, very, very excited to share this vlog to you guys because this is one of the most requested. Like, ever since I posted pictures on my weight loss journey, you have been sending me DMs, a lot of questions as to how I did this. And this is finally it. This video, I will try to speak in Tagalog and English. I want myself to be honest. I want to maintain transparency. I want to share everything that I did in order to lose weight. Everything that I have to say in this vlog is out of my own experiences. So I'm not gonna say that this works best for everyone. Pero I hope, I really hope it does. Since I'm gonna expose everything that I do, I hope you guys will like and subscribe to my channel if you haven't already. Because I'm gonna tell you guys everything that I did. Starting off with my weight, I was 56 before the whole process, before all of this began. And my goal is to go back to my weight. I gained weight because of college stress. I've been eating a lot of sweets every single night. Actually guys, this top, I got this from Lazada. I actually had a story about this on Instagram and everyone is asking where I got this top top from for 200 pesos I think so it's not that expensive and it fits really well actually look at the back see it looks really good I like it if you want this as well you can go check the link in the description box below so yeah um the first thing that I did is to cut off carbs and watch my calorie intake I am not calculating my calories it's just na I have to cut off rice I have to cut off soft drinks. I know some of you guys cannot live without rice because as Filipinos, rice is our staple food. If hindi nyo kaya mag cut off rice like ASAP, you can just gradually cut off rice. Instead of rice, I have weight bread. There's a lot of weight bread brands. Mga potatoes. So, potatoes for me is a very good alternative. Potatoes are yummy. And you can do mashed potatoes, potato wedges. There are a lot of recipes online, so pwedeng pwede nyo yan i-check out online kung anong pwede nyo magawa. I don't drink soft drinks anymore. As much as possible, I drink juice. Juice that are healthy, um, juice that are natural. Aside that it's yummier, like for me lang ha, aside that it's really good, it's better than soft drinks. It's also healthier, so you can go choose that one as an alternative. And I do salads, so salads, Maybe some of you will say na salads are gross, na hindi kayo kumakain na, you know, just plain vegetables and <laughs> all of that. I know, I really understand na may mga tao talaga na hindi kaya kumain ng salads. The dressings actually make a difference, so choose dressings that for you are yummy para ma maubos na yung salads nyo. I add the things that I like on my salad in order for me to like the salad. Do I still eat breakfast? So my answer for that is yes, I do eat breakfast since I am a morning person now. Which is something I'm proud to announce. My favorite breakfast includes number one, eggs. Scrambled or not scrambled or boiled eggs. Just eggs. Tuna. You can have century tuna. Century, oh my god, not sponsored. Basta tuna is really good. And another is oatmeal. So. Oatmeal is one of the best breakfast food as well. Everything that I mentioned are actually heavy food. Enough for you to start off your day. I do not recommend for you to um, skip your breakfast because breakfast is one of the most important. It's not one of the, it's actually the most important meal of the day. So please don't skip your breakfast. To be really honest with you guys, sometimes I don't eat lunch because I'm still full from my breakfast. Or at least I try to convince myself. For my dinner, however, I have to be honest with you guys. I don't eat dinner as much as possible. I don't, except if the food is irresistible. Pero, as an alternative for dinner, I do smoothies. Smoothies, also known as fruit shakes in the Philippines. If you follow me on my Instagram, you know that I constantly share some of my recipes for my smoothies. So if you're not following me on Instagram, follow me at, at Jishin Kaila. I share every now and then. I actually got this idea from my best friend. She doesn't eat um, beyond 4 p.m. In order for our body to have a lot of time to grind all the food, 
We just don't eat at 4 p.m. It depends on you guys, ha, if you'll follow this because of course we are not dietitians and I'm not really sure if this is 100% healthy. So I am not 100% encouraging you guys to do the same things. But since I wanted to be honest and I wanted to tell you everything that I do, this is what we do. So Yun, I hope I answered all the questions regarding about my breakfast, lunch, and dinner. If you want to know the specifics on what I eat in a day or what I eat in a week video, I can do a separate video for that one. I drink teas a lot. I actually got this from my best friends as well. So they encouraged me to drink teas. I am never a hot tea person. It worked for me. I was surprised na when I started drinking teas. I actually um, withdraw every day. A good sign that my metabolism is boosting up. So for me, ha, it worked for me. The brand that I'm using is Lipton because that's all we have in here. So I'm actually happy because my mom is into teas and when I ask her if meron ba kami tea, meron naman. These are actually accessible in your local supermarket so you can just buy and it's not that expensive. So you can try hot teas. Any brand will do, I guess. If you have specific brands that you think will work best for everyone, you can leave a comment down below and, you know, let's just help each other. I drink tea once or twice a day. Um, my people are telling me na you can drink a maximum of three cups a day. But for me, I only do once or twice because I have veneers. The question is, did I cut off my coffee? If you're following me on my social media accounts, you know that I really love coffee. I think that's also one of the reasons why I gained weight. If you want to lose weight, you are allowed to drink coffee. The thing is, you have you just have to make sure na hindi masyado marami yung sugar content ng coffee. People are recommending me black Americano coffee, which is super pait. It has no taste at all. If you don't want to cut off coffee, just have the no fat, no dairy, no milk, no sugar coffee. And is that even a coffee still? <laughs> to answer the question, I had to cut off my coffee. But I still drink coffee occasionally, maybe once or twice a month. <laughs> Yun lang. It was hard for me, to be honest. It was, but we magagawa. Weight loss. So yeah, I did mention that uh, I don't eat beyond 4 p.m. And the question is, what if Jashin will get hungry beyond 4 p.m.? So what I basically do, I eat. I don't deprive myself. Pero the only thing that I eat is fruits. Are fruits. I do have fruits as my snacks. You will need a lot of fruits for your smoothie, for your snacks. And trust me, it works. 100% it works. Question is, um, do you drink water? Of course, I do drink water. That's a stupid question. I drink at least 3 to 4. Since it's summer, we have to drink a lot of um, water. Um, for that, it's not only just water. I infuse my water with lemon. And we all know lemon works best, especially when you are trying to lose weight. It would help your metabolism, I guess. Correct me if I'm wrong. I actually add lemon on my tea. Lemon has a lot of benefits. It just sucks how lemons are like kind of expensive. It's slightly overpriced in some places in the Philippines. So I hope in your place, lemons are not overpriced because here in our province, it's kind of overpriced. But for the sake of losing weight, you know. I also add collagen powder. The brand is Bello. It's kind of pricey, a little bit pricey. Uh, one box with like seven sticks is 700 and I bought two boxes of them. I got it from Lazada just recently and it tastes good naman. Um, collagen drink is not entirely for weight loss. It could help you with your weight loss. Vitamin E and vitamin C. But for me, ha, vitamin C is not optional. Especially now that we're facing a pandemic. Your health is very important. Make this as a priority as of the moment because that's honestly your weapon. And next is vitamin E. Vitamin E is not for everyone. Take note, please. There's a TikTok video that I made. Um, it's in relation to losing weight. A person who commented na vitamin E is not for everyone, especially for those who have oily skin. So please be cautious with this one. Some are vitamin E intolerant. Is that how you call it? My vitamin E brand is actually Myra E. It's like the only brand I know for vitamin E. But I'm, I'm pretty sure there's a lot available on the market. I am subject to be corrected because I am not a dietitian or a doctor or a practicing nurse or whatsoever. 
Alright, so we're almost done in this video. Um, the last thing, is it the last bath that I did in order for me to lose weight? Is two drum rolls workout. Maybe majority of you guys listening here are not into working out, but hear me out. First of all, I am never a workout person. My friends, my boyfriend, and my family know how much of a lazy person I am. I am never into working out. Like, I swear to God, the idea of working out just exhausts me even before doing it. So, guys, trust me, just try. Try for Siguro two weeks. So, I know this program. It's very popular right now. It's a program by Chloe Ting. ChloeTing.com. Go to that website. Actually, I'm gonna link everything down below. So, go to the description down below and you can go search up for Chloe Ting Workouts for two weeks. <sighs> and the question that I get a lot is what particular program or particular workout programs do I follow? Like, I don't have my own workout that I actually originally came up with. I follow videos on YouTube. So all of the videos that I follow are listed down below. Everything that you need, all the links, the links for this one, the, literally everything that you need in this video. So there's another question if I still work out during my period, if I have my period. The answer is yes. One of the reasons why I actually started to work out is to get my period. Again, I was super unhappy, so I would miss my period like three months that's so bad then after like three days of working out three straight days of working out i got my period and working out helps a lot if you're a regular if you're like me very unhealthy so i might think as well that working out will help you get your period back or i actually work out after breakfast if i can so that's before lunch or during the lunch time and before dinner so mostly before dinner just because I have all the time before dinner. This is where I get motivation from. I actually have two best friends and both of them are into working out and they just started this quarantine. Michelle and Jean, um, they're actually doing a great job. Keeps me motivated as well. And another is my boyfriend. So my boyfriend is actually like my virtual online trainer. So he's been working out for more than a year now. And yeah, we do send progress pictures, progress videos, and trust me guys, you really need a body. You really need someone to help you stay motivated and having these people around me, my boyfriend and my best friends, is a blessing to me because <laughs> they really honestly help me. So yeah, I think that is everything that I have to say naman siguro. Um, yun lang. For me, just don't be too hard on yourself guys. What actually alarms me is that most of the people are, who are asking me this are people younger than me. So guys, kids, don't be too hard on yourself. It took me five weeks to get the visible results that I have now. So please, please don't be too hard on yourself. Just take it easy. Everything I said actually requires a lot of self-control, a lot of discipline. The first week is actually the hardest. So I hope you stay motivated. I hope, I hope, and I wish, and I hope, and I wish, and I'm praying that this vlog will help you. So yeah, I'm um, wishing you guys all the best. You've got no excuse. Just do whatever I said if it's applicable to you. That is it for this vlog. I hope you thumbs up this video, subscribe to my channel, and comment down below. Visit all my social media accounts. My Twitter, my Instagram, my Snapchat, it's at Jushin Kaila. And my TikTok, which I'm not sure if... I'm still active. Pero in TikTok, it's at Jushin with double N. So, 